like a wrecking ball. If you like that version of Wrecking Ball, special thanks to Troy. Check out his band, Forever Starts Today. Go on their Facebook page. We will provide a link where you can download that track. We here at Architect of Aesthetics. Break things down to build a better you. All right, thanks for listening in, guys. I'm John Dow, the Boston Architect, joined by my co-host. Chase Irwin, the Little Rock Architect. With our new brand here, the Architects of Aesthetics. Uh, formerly, if you were listening into the podcast, we had the Jack and Out connection, but we're taking a much more serious, so to speak, fitness stance by actually including lots of fitness talk. Not just uh, coming at you with lots of giggling, although we- there will be lots of giggling. <laughs> what we're going to do is we're going to review some of the things that you might have missed this month. Uh, but in addition, uh, one thing that we haven't produced anything about, but we just like to talk about, dude, I was going to tell you, I was reading in the latest issue of Shape magazine. I read a lot of those women's fitness magazines, in addition to the guys' ones. And they said the number one move that women aren't doing enough. You want to take a guess what it was? The squat. Good guess. It's another big three move. Bench press. No. Nah. The deadlift. Yeah, the deadlift. <laughs> So I thought that was appropriate since uh, I've been getting my girlfriend to deadlift pretty regularly. And last week was the first time we did like a kind of not high volume, but just lots of sets in the workout. I think we did eight sets, of one, one to twos, you know? And so her doms after that were pretty serious. And I kind of forgot that when you're deadlifting for the first time, I think those doms, are some of the hardest to recognize. You know, when you get doms from deadlifting, you sometimes really think like you hurt yourself because yeah, they can and, be and for really everyone intense. who's listening, what John's talking about is delayed onset uh, muscle soreness. It's uh, it's when your muscles get sore uh, about a day after you uh, you've worked out. So I just wanted to make sure we <laughs> clarified that. <laughs> People are like doms. <laughs> what did Dom do to his back? That's so messed up. Any fitness point that stood out to you this um, past month? Yeah, man. Uh, something, something that uh, is maybe for folks who've been lifting a little a little while now, uh, probably six months or longer. Uh, a great video series that just started on the Team Three D M J channel on YouTube, um, and Eric Helms is is doing the video series, and it's called the Muscle and Strength Training Pyramid. And he breaks down the most important parts of working out and, and something very great for people who are just starting or have been lifting for a little while to recognize where they need to be spending their time uh, and not spinning their wheels on things that are not as important to their success. So I would definitely recommend going out there and watching that and keeping up with him because he is just – a super intelligent guy for the we're all about not wasting any time maximizing yeah. all the efficiency on that cool man absolutely what you might have missed in conjunction with the avengers age of ultron release we built a better quicksilver and also helped out the hulk who stopped by with a certain body problem he too big we also had an article the flip side of empathy this was in response to mike vacanti our bud here just being really upset with people who overeat because they're bored he was struggling with empathizing with them and i just wanted to point out the problem with giving people too much empathy yeah we don't want to give you too much room to work stay in your lane (laughs) and no bumpers back on the video front we did an awesome review of the Furious 7 that I believe, Chase, you still haven't seen yet. Nope. But we did talk about the mechanics of deadlifting a car. And then I watched today that Ronda Rousey said that Shaq could last 45 seconds in the ring with her. I thought Shaq said he could last 45 seconds in the ring with her. He did, but she agreed. <laughs> okay. And then finally, our latest video release, Why Fad Diets Work, Specifically Smoothie Diets. And we'll be releasing our new diet material (laughs) later this week. By the way, one more thing. If you are looking for a new routine to take you through summer, uh, we're starting our Chasing Volume group on Fitocracy for the 
for under 50 bucks a month. So, I mean, check it out. You get to work with us for three months and, you know, we're going to have a good time. As always, you can reach me on Twitter, C-O-M-M-D-A-O, -M -M or Chase. At Blackout Trainer. All right, guys, that about does it for the wrap-up. Be sure to leave us comments. Let us know which ones you liked in case you missed any of them. Uh, let us know what material you'd like to see more of because we're kind of in the dark as far as that goes. Yeah, and I don't mean we're blacked out.